What's up, what's up, YouTube? Flyers fan here from Mike's TV on YouTube.com, bringing you another defensive tip, guys. This time we're going to come out of the dime defense, out of the 146. We're going to look at the strong eagle three, um, strong or straight eagle slant three. Um, we're gonna any gun formation here. We're offset because that's a very popular, very popular offense. So you guys can see I put the running back to block, uh, base line, show blitz, edge rush, bluff blitz. Put this guy in the flat. Um, then you can do anything with your coverage, um, per se, however you want it. Just hold this guy here in the gap. Hold the LT, and you should get some pressure coming in just like that. Um, you have that linebacker coming in looping. So baseline, show blitz, edge rush. You can put this guy in any coverage you want. Whatever you feel like your opponent is doing, hold this guy here. LT, and then you guys, you guys can see that the pressure is coming in really quick through that A gap, B gap. I don't even know what these gaps are. I know it's going to come. So you can make any adjustments you want. Um, it depends on what the guy likes to do. Um, so just imagine if a running back was not blocking, okay, the pressure is should come in a lot faster. I think I messed up on a step there. So let's try it again. I like to do this, you know, for adjustment wise. You know, like I said, I mean, just make whatever adjustments you want. And you guys can see, I guess, it's because the guy's going over the middle. So. I'm going to try to continue. You guys can see at that time it went in. So the, he took a different angle there because, so especially if they got somebody going over the middle, then just contain just for, um, for he doesn't run into the guy there. comes in really quick especially if there's not a running back blocking but the coverage behind it is pretty good um you should be able to get decent decent pressure here and like i said i mean you know you can do whatever adjustments you want And you guys can see with the running back blocking, it's just still coming in. And he just like looped around. He went after Davis. Number whatever number was that, fifty-eight. And so let's look at the replay here, guys. Um, <clears throat> so you guys can see, you're only sending five, and you got coverage in the back. But you guys, you see that they loop around, and by the time number twenty-eight Hyde decides to go after number fifty-three. After number 53, it's too late because now he's after Davis. And like I said, you have the flats covered. Um, but once you see that the the blitz is coming through, then you can just move your guy and cover whatever you want. So here goes the blitz again, guys. They loop around and they bump in, but, you know, the blitz comes in. So we're going to try it one more time, guys. So it's baseline, show blitz, edge rush. Bluff blitz, or actually QB contain, bluff blitz, put this guy in a flat. Um, and then say we're going to put the running back to block, pass commit, and then you guys can see. Now that time, for some odd reason, 
hide. Grab the guy there. I don't know what went wrong there. So let's try again. Baseline show bliss edge rush. Even if you do that and just bluff blitz this guy here. Now, the potty make high just go that way. But you guys can see, even with um, the running back not blocking, it's coming in really. So, baseline show blitz, edge rush. Put this guy in a flat, bluff blitz this guy here. Change it up. See what we get. And you guys can see that number 25 came. So, <clears throat> easy setup, guys. Um, you know, there's whatever adjustments you make. Like I said, I mean, it'll be hard for you to throw on this. So, based on that. Like this. If you have a faster guy there, you'll probably get a much better result, guys. So, you got I me, mean, you guys can go ahead and toy around with this. As you guys can see, I fucked up there, big. And that's if they're not blocking anybody, guys. So, and that's if only they're blocking the run. Get that double edge, but you guys can see with the running back blocking, it came in. See that? So we're gonna look at this replay again. See hide does he at the first doesn't even know who to go after so by the time it's just too late number 53 misses but you have your defensive end cleaning up the act and you got the pressure in the, and you know you got coverage in the back so hopefully you guys enjoy this blitz flyers fan from mike's tv on you.com signing out